Here's Lou Macari beaten by Sunes. Here's Dalglish. It's going to find Case. Still Case. He scored a fine individual goal at that end against Arsenal last week to mark his return to the side, Jimmy Case. And when you look back at Liverpool's results, he is a very important player in their team. Richie, that's a good turn. Oh, what a very good move. Joe Jordan came in there and very nearly put Manchester United in front and Clements makes the defence because they were caught short again, Liverpool. Richie made the opening on the left, he got round nicely, it was a fierce cross and Jordan came hurling himself in and might well have scored. That's on by Johnson. Dalglish! Oh, what a good save! The play set up by David Johnson with the flick header but it took Dalglish only a split second to turn and wrap in the shot, which Bailey, going to his right, did just as well to save. Kennedy came in, so did Thompson. It was away in the end by Alberston. Here's Thompson. Alan Kennedy. Did that nicely. Dalglish! His 22nd of the season for Liverpool, and a goal beautifully made for him by Alan Kennedy, who over on the left-hand side there, checked, came back inside Steve Koppel, delivered the cross to the far post, and Dalglish put it away. Still City. McDermott. Sunes didn't get a hold of that. And you have the feeling, watching the Liverpool team, especially the midfield players, that they've put their minds today to doing what they couldn't quite do in the semi-final. Here's Nickel. Ritchie and United in a good position here with Koppel. Plenty of support inside. Makari! And that might well have been the equaliser. Steve Koppel broke well down the right wing. He had good support in the middle from Makari nearest to him who didn't quite get the height on it. Or shall we say that Clements was at his most alert. Thomas. Just overran that slightly, and here's Ray Kennedy with Case breaking on the right. Liverpool have played that ball so well this afternoon. McDermott is in support inside, and Phil Neal's made a run from the back. Still Case. There's Neal! Oh, I say! Phil Neal! So delighted as well he might be because this today is his 250th match for Liverpool Football Club in the first team, and he celebrates with a lovely goal. Neil saw his chance there to join the attack from a deep position. He was well found by Case, and he slid the ball plus Bailey. Thomas. Nothing given. Bill Thompson, I think, uh, <laughs> enjoying himself, and the referee quite convinced that Thomas took a dive. But Liverpool allowing Manchester United no respite at all. Neil. The ball against Greenoff. Here's McDermott. Johnson. Wide is Case, waiting in the centre, Dalglish and Ray Kennedy. Away by Greenock. Case again. Johnson should have done better. Ray Kennedy. It's all one way. Dalglish. Hansen for Liverpool. Dalglish. Still there, Dalglish, and Buchan got in.
the way of the shot because Stalglish knew it was on its way. He's obviously going to haunt them right up to the end, having opened the scoring in the first half. Martin Buchan got in the way. And soon as has got McDermott running down the right. He's still running. Soon as makes his way into the penalty area, joined by three others. Johnson came in. He's got Thomas down the left. Coppel just inside. Feels for offside, not given. Thomas is cross, hooked away by Neil. Thomas again. Comes a chance here at the end for Manchester United. Oh, and Kennedy missed it, and so did Bakari, and Coppel's there. And so is Neil. What a mess. Bakari's header. Then Coppel and. Oh, out the hands of the goalkeeper by Hans. What is going on back there? It's almost carnival time in the penalty area, right at the end. I think even Clemens can see the funny side of it. It was really his ball then, surely. Thomas, McElroy, finally driven wide, and the referee puts an end to the match, which was really completed on a fairly humorous note. But Liverpool will be in good spirits because they have completed the double in the league over the team who knocked them out of the FA Cup semi final. A goal in each half, and a goal in which the fullbacks played a part because Phil Neal got the second just after half time, and the first one was made by his. Other fullback partner Alan Kennedy for Kenny Dalglish. So a good team performance by Liverpool, who ran the match in the second half. And surely now one has to feel that the championship of the first division looks like coming to Anfield for the 11th time. Liverpool 2, Manchester United 0.